friends and family, so nice to see you for devotions again. I'm so excited about sharing our church values with you and today we're talking about the abundant grace of God. I'm going to read to you out of 2 Peter 1 verse 2 to 3 in the, in the King James Version. Grace and peace be multiplied unto you through the knowledge of God and Jesus our Lord. According as His divine power has given us all things that pertain unto life and godliness through the knowledge of Him that has called us to glory and virtue. I want to encourage you today, my friend, you've been called to glory and virtue. God wants you to live a glorious and a virtuous life. And the way we do that is by accessing the abundant grace of God. The scripture talks about the fact that grace and peace can be multiplied to you. It means it can be made a lot more than it is right now. So let's, let's trust the Lord for His multiplied grace in our lives. But how do we get that to come into our lives? It is by understanding the character of God. Twice in this passage, it talks about we need to have knowledge of God and Jesus Christ our Lord. So let's look at this. A lot of people don't believe that Jesus is actually God. Jesus is who the Lord is. So what happens is we don't understand the fact that Jesus presents the person of God. God has pre presented Himself in the person of Jesus. So if Jesus is not going to make somebody sick, then God's not going to make them sick. If Jesus is not going to make somebody poor, but He's going to provide their, their needs, then God's going to do the same thing. Jesus is who God is. And we need to understand that God has, has revealed Himself in the New Testament according to the person of Christ. And so a lot of us are standing next to the river of grace and we are hearing about it. But we won't leap in our hearts into that river because we still have a wrong picture of who God is. And I want to encourage you, my friend, you can trust God. Every good and perfect gift comes from God. And when we judge God's character right, then we will start understanding and accessing the grace of God. So I believe this for you, my friend, that grace and peace will be multiplied in your life by just embracing the true character of God revealed in the person of Jesus. You are highly favored and deeply loved of God. Hello Lira, thanks for recording again. You are the best, best editor in the whole wide world. I can Still bookmark Okay. Bookmark <laughs> <laughs>